Hey guys, so I just got this awesome convertible jet pump and it is going to help me water an area in my yard that is fresh dirt and I want it to grow grass so I need to keep it wet. And so I am going to use this and take the water that I've collected in this bucket and use it to water this. Since it is a good distance away from the house, this is going to really save me a lot of time versus carrying buckets and using a sprinkler water pail. And so I'm going to get right into it. Now this is a heavy duty cast iron convertible jet pump, which is capable of pumping water out of shallow wells as well as deep wells down to 90 feet. So it's got a lot of power behind it and can really be beneficial in a whole lot of other areas, not just the area I'm going to use it for today. If you've got a shallow well, or a well that's under 90 feet deep, which consists of a lot of different wells, then you should be able to use this very effectively to pump up water. It's capable of being paired with a pressurized tank so that you can get water, pressurize it, and be able to live off of it, perhaps with an RV camper or even for your home. And so first off, I'm going to get this all set up it does have a couple functions that I want to point out, so I'm going to bring the camera in closer and show you everything that I'm doing here. All right, so here it is. It's got the two ports down here for the extra su suction, and then this will mount right onto here and allow me to screw on this PVC pipe and will suck out of my container. And so that is what I'm going to do. Beyond that, they give you some extra pieces here, some seals for up here, and some extra fittings. So I'm going to be using that. And then, right in here, we'll take off this and convert it. You can either use 230 volts or 115. I'm going to convert it to 115. It does come preset for 230, so you'll definitely want to make sure if you're using 115, you'll switch it over before you start using it. this separate fitting which will attach here on the discharge area where I can hook up a hose and water this area. Now before I go any further I do want to prime this put some water in here so the motor doesn't run dry. You can do that two ways if you've already got the hose attached you can take this plug out here and then put the water through or like I'm doing I'm just going to run the water through here and fill this pub up so that it doesn't run dry. And then here on the other side of this tube is another bolt. And that will be to drain it once you're done and you want to winterize it. You don't want any water to stay in here. You just take that bolt out and that will drain it and allow you to be good to go. Alright, so there you saw just how powerful this thing is. It can push through water like nobody's business and it can suck it up through that inch and a quarter PVC tube and it has no problem getting water. And so if you're in the market for a good shallow well or deep well pump, then this is certainly something that I would highly recommend checking into. It is perfect for me. It has so many purposes and it's truly a wonderful and helpful tool to have around. 